My son's name is Caleb. He is six weeks, or well, he'll be six weeks on Monday. <laughs> Um, when I came in, I was very nervous because I was still in denial. Being the pastor's daughter, for me, myself, it was hard because I was trying to live two lifestyles at one time, being the pastor's daughter and going to church every Sunday and putting on this facade and then at the same time doing another lifestyle. Just having a, a support system. And if you don't have an outside support system, I so totally recommend PDHC because they give you that. It's, they become extended family for you, you know, <laughs> like an aunt and uncle, you know. So it's very comforting and it makes your pregnancy so much smoother. I'm eight months pregnant right now. I'm having a little girl and her name is going to be Sanaya Ellen Lee Shelvin. PDHC is a great way to get educated about what you're about to go into. It's a great way to get things that you need for the baby that you're not prepared for. It's a great way to get the support, you know, um, just mentally, just be all right with where you are and what you're doing and the baby. Linda has been an awesome help. She has went on her, her way to just be a comfort to me and, you know, a friend, somebody I can talk to, somebody I can console in. She's, she's a really great listener. So I couldn't talk to my parents about my joy of being pregnant and PDHC made it comforting to do so, to talk about, oh, I'm excited, oh, I felt him move, oh, this, I learned this at the doctors or, you know, learning the, the information. She even prayed with me and that was a blessing to me that made me with, feel more welcomed and more relaxed. It makes me feel comfortable. It makes me feel like, you know, I have somebody to talk to. You know, my parents both are deceased, so it, it's really hard, you know, to get that, that kind of conversation or that kind of comfort and love just from someone, just speaking to somebody and you know they, they mean well. It made me feel human. You know, it's, it's welcoming and we're in our own heads like, what am I about to do? My thoughts myself was, what am I doing? Why I'm bringing my child into a broken home. I'm, I thought of all the negatives of it, but Miss Linda allowed me to see the positives of it. As in, God has a plan. You have to be willing to accept the help.